All right, guys, this is what we're going to do for you today. I'm going to make this short and sweet. We're going to open those gaming ports. So you're uh, for Xbox Live, and um, <clears throat> so you don't you don't have to worry about not being able to join your friends' games and stuff just because you have a strict or a moderate NAT type. So we're going to change it to open. Now open up a web browser, Internet Explorer, Firefox, Aries, whatever. Just open that up. That's going to be used in just a second. Uh, go to your, um, uh, open two of them, smart. Go to your command prompt. Okay, you can do that. I've got mine right here. You can do that by going to your run, CMD. Pretty simple there. Type in IP config. All right, you can get a whole bunch of stuff like that right there. But the only thing you're worried about is your default gateway. It says it right there. Default gateway. Get that number. Now, you can, if uh, you want to, you can mark it and copy it, but just memorize it um, and type it in in your web browser. Most of the time, it for Linksys routers, it's a uh, 192.168.1.1. But mine's a little different, so just type in that right there. Now you're going to be prompted with a uh, username and password. The default is a blank username and admin for the password. Uh, sometimes, you know, maybe your parents changed it or you've changed it, but if you have, type in the, uh, the stuff that you've set. But if not, the default is blank username, admin is the password. You're going to be logged into your Linksys router. Okay, and what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna go to want to go to applications and gaming, and your applications are gonna be Xbox One, Two, Three, and Four, XBL, just whatever you feel like labeling it to know that it's for your Xbox. All right, and then you're gonna want to find your IP address for your X. Uh, you can do that by getting on your Xbox and typing in, or not typing in, go into your uh, system settings. Um, configure network, and it says it right there for you. Uh, IP address, and then type in the remaining numbers in your IP address, and forward the start and end of 53, 80, 88, and 3074. Some people like to change these to the desired TCP or UDP. Just hit both. Works just fine. Enable by checking all the boxes, and then save your settings. Settings are successful. So there you go. That should do the trick of uh, opening up those ports and clo opening your nap type and you should be able to play with your friends pretty smoothly now. If that doesn't work, I have another another thing you could try. So just, you know, if this worked, if you liked the video, subscribe to it. If not, let me know and I'll try to get it worked out for you. Uh, thanks. Thanks for watching.